it was flight 5022, Spanair flight 5022. For those of us just joining us, uh, this incident which happened at Barojas Airport in Madrid on the main runway, uh, this uh, airplane overshooting the runway. And we see those pictures, uh, a serious uh, incident, accident, as, as Al, as you were saying, we see the plumes of smoke rising. It, it looks very serious. Injuries uh, are expected and feared by airport officials. Uh, and Al, you were saying that basically this airport is equipped to take care of such an incident. It has, and it has very good, a very good safety record. Well, indeed, accidents are infrequent at this airport. Uh, having reported here from Madrid for some years, uh, I can't recall. I'm going to have to check on when the, the last major sort of accident if this amounts to that but clearly the with the installation of the new terminal uh in the last couple of years not only the flashy glass new buildings there are two buildings that comprise that separated by this main sort of north south runway but also you see the fire stations uh in place up there uh, as well as a fire emergency station, of course, is in place near the older terminals, terminals 1, 2, and 3, which are together. Um, so it's sort of an L-shaped airport or a T-shaped airport with the Terminal 4 uh, uh, on the long part and the older part uh, at the bottom of the T, if you will, if yeah. you can imagine the airport. Really, sir? Al, uh, just the pictures that we were showing, I hadn't seen the picture that we were showing right before the Google map, but there were two columns of smoke, a white one and a black column of smoke. I hadn't seen that before. Uh, what can you tell us about uh, what you've been able to find out about whether the plane uh, was on fire? Uh, was it on fire in two places? Did it break up? Uh, it's just incredible. These are the pictures I'm talking about. This is the first time I'm seeing this. You see on the left column, I don't know if you can see that, Al, there's a plume of white smoke and to the right there's a, a plume of, of darker smoke. Uh, presumably, it's from the same plane, uh, maybe from two different sections of the plane, or maybe a portion of the plane. If indeed it was an engine burning, maybe that fell off. We just we don't have those details. But I'm looking at those pictures as well, um, Relita, and we're trying to get out to the airport. <clears throat> you can see that highway. It appears to me, yes, that would be the newer one of the newer terminals as they're pulling back um, uh, an area that theoretically is well equipped to take care of this. Um, hospitals are just minutes away if indeed there are injuries, and that's what the official said as he expected, that, that there would be injuries.